Constantine Heraclius Augustus, 626-641, commonly known by the diminutive Heraclonus or Heracleondas, or really, Heraclius II, was the son of Heraclius and his niece Martina, and was Byzantine emperor briefly between February and September 641. He was baptized and officially reigned as Flavius Constantinus Heraclius, but the diminutive nickname Heraclonus, Little Heraclius, became established in Byzantine texts and has become standard in historiography. Heraclonus was probably born at Lazica while his father was on campaign against Khosrau II of the Sassanid Empire. He was probably the fourth son of Martina and Heraclius, but the first one born free of physical deformity and eligible for the throne. Towards the end of Heraclius' a reign he obtained through his mother's influence the title of Augustus on July 4, 638, and after his father's death was proclaimed joint emperor with his older half-brother Constantine III. The premature death of Constantine III, in May 641, left Heraclonus sole ruler, but a suspicion that he and Martina had murdered Constantine led soon after to a revolt under the general Valentinus, who forced Heraclonus to accept his young nephew Constans II as co-ruler. Martina intended to balance this setback with the coronation of her younger son, the Caesar David, as emperor. But this merely irritated the supporters of Constans II, and Valentinus spread rumors that Martina and Heraclonus intended to eliminate Constans and his supporters. The revolt which ensued toppled Heraclonus and his mother, who were subjected to mutilation and banishment. This was the first time a reigning emperor had been subjected to mutilation, which was a practice probably borrowed from the Persians, in this case. Martina's tongue and Heraclonus's nose were cut out. Nothing further is known about Heraclonus after his removal and exile to Rhodes. He is presumed to have died later that year. Constans II, the son of Constantine III, became sole emperor.